Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to do a continuous I-chord cast-on. Um, and it's unique in that you can, um, in that it, it continues up into an I-chord edging. So I've seen other I-chord castings, cast-ons, um, that you do an I-chord cast-on and then you can continue on one side, um, but with this method you can actually continue up both sides. Um, seamlessly and then I'll also in a later video show you how to do the cast off so that your entire um, knit piece can be surrounded in I-cord. So you do need um, circular needles for this method so I'm just going to show you on these giant ones. Um, take your needles and hold them parallel and put your tail in the back and uh, place the yarn over the top needle. Uh, then you're going to keep your, your hands in this orientation and take the top yarn and go underneath and between the bottom needle and back to base position. Then take your bottom yarn and go between and over the top of the needle. <clears throat> and then you're just going to repeat that. So with the top yarn underneath and between, bottom yarn between, over the top. Top yarn underneath and between. And then for this... Um, I'm just going to show you how to do a three stitch uh, cast on and edging. So you just need three stitches on each needle. Once you have that, flip the needles over. Oh, this cast, cast on method is, um, is called Judy's Magic Cast On, and I've just adapted it into this um, I chord continuous method. So, uh, yeah. So, anyway, flip the needles over and pull out the bottom needle. And then you're just going to knit these three stitches. Uh, this first stitch is a little awkward because this, of this tail, but just hold that in place and pretend like it's a stitch and knit three. Oops. Okay, big needles. <laughs> um, knit three stitches and then just place those same three stitches back on your left hand needle and do that again. Knit three stitches. So, and then two, three. And then put those same three stitches back. <clears throat> and at this point, you can start to see the I cord forming. Um, but you can pull your needle through the back through on put these three stitches on and now we're going to start um, with the casting on so in other i cord cast ons they'll tell you to knit into the front and the back of this first stitch um, but i just find that that doesn't look as clean for me when i do it that way so um, i do it this way um, i knit into the stitch below so this is the stitch that this one's coming out of, and I take the back leg from behind and place it on the needle, and then knit into it. So then that's one stitch made, and then you just knit three. And repeat that process. So you put three stitches back, and then make a stitch. And knit three. <clears throat> and I'll do that one more time and show you how to turn the corner. Um, so, just these three stitches back. And you can see how these three stitches are going to continue up um, for the I cord edging, and then these two stitches are um, like in the body of the work. <laughs> um, but here we'll make one more. So take the back leg, stick it on the needle, knit one, knit three. Okay, and just for the demo, let's say we only needed nine stitches on our needles, so. We're there, we have three, six, nine. And, but this corner uh, is just a little cut off. So in order to, uh, 
make the I cord long enough to, to turn the corner, we're going to put the three stitches back on the needle and just knit one more row for these three stitches. So put them back on and, and don't make one, just knit three. <clears throat> And then you're done with the cast on and you're ready to go. Um, so at least in the in the patterns that I have um, written, I do the I cord uh, edging by always slipping the first three on the wrong side. So when you're on the wrong side of the work, you just cast on, that was the right side. This is the wrong side. So you just slip three stitches with the yarn in front and then do whatever you need to for the pattern. I'm just going to do garter stitch here. And then when you get to the other I cord edge, you just do the same thing. Put the yarn in front and slip three stitches. And then on the right side, um, you don't need to do anything different. You'll just do, you'll just knit across all the stitches. So these are the three for the edging and you just knit them. And you can pull your yarn, yarn tight uh, back there so that it Makes the eye cord nice and tight. Um, garter stitch, so I'll just knit the three middle stitches. And knit the three edge stitches. And then you can see your piece. Um, kind of hard on these big needles and giant yarn, but you have... <clears throat> Um, an I cord cast on that's going seamlessly into the I cord edging. Thanks for watching.